Hello again and welcome to our weekly seminar. Our topic today, buying you truck. Starting a business requires a significant capital investment. Only a few startups have succeeded on a shoestring budget. This is especially true for the trucking industry. The startup owner operator needs cash for the down payment on a truck, the registration, permits, and insurance as well as for the day-to-day -day operation before revenue will come in. Buying that first truck is an emotional experience. The decision will have long-term implications. Therefore, you must carefully research the market. Although you may dream of a fancy, new truck, a good quality used truck with a modest monthly payment will make more sense for the owner-operator who has to gain experience. Most owner-operators prefer long-nosed trucks, but for the beginner cabovers offer better value for the money, because they are considerably cheaper than conventional trucks. A buyer can choose from a huge selection of pre-owned trucks, which are offered through internet auctions, used truck sale magazines, dealerships, private parties, and manufacturer. A. Fuel costs make up a significant part of the operating expenses, and a fuel-efficient truck can greatly improve the operation's bottom line. An owner-operator will need between $5,000 and $10,000 just for the cost associated with the purchase of a good used truck. Used truck prices range from $10,000 to $60,000 but a good four to five year old cab over should sell for approximately twenty thousand dollars the finance company will require a down payment of ten to twenty percent depending on the buyers credit rating and may also require a co-signer interest rates generally are higher than regular vehicle loans because only a few companies specialize in truck financing additional expenditures include the registration fee license plate and operating permits as well as insurance premiums. The owner-operator will need several types of coverage. Department of Transportation regulations require liability coverage, however, other coverage, such as physical damage or workers' compensation, may be also necessary. Owner-operators make a down payment on insurance premiums and finance the annual premium, making monthly payments. About 15 insurance companies specialize in truck insurance, most require three monthly premiums upfront, which amounts to several thousand dollars, and nine monthly payments. The owner-operator will need also financial resources to cover several weeks of operating expenses until revenue starts flowing in. Some brokers may pay right away when you present documents that you have delivered the load, but most brokers and lease-on carriers will make weekly or bi-weekly disbursements. Visit the truck dealerships in your area and check the equipment they have in stock. When you talk to a salesperson, ask questions and take notes. You should have prepared a list of items you need to know to help you make a purchase decision. Some of the questions you need to ask should include How many miles are on the chassis? How many miles are on the major components such as the engine, transmission, differentials, turbocharger, power steering? and air conditioning. Is the truck or certain components still under factory warranty, does the dealership offer a warranty, are used equipment warranties available? Who performed the truck maintenance and where, are maintenance records available? For what type of service was the truck used for? How many previous owners, in what climate was the truck operated, does the truck have all original components? If not, which components have been replaced and why? If not, which components have been replaced and why, has the engine been overhauled? Has the truck been in an accident or collision? Has the truck been in an accident or collision? Ask additional questions and demand explanations or clarifications if you do not understand what the salesperson is telling you. You need to make sure that you learn as much as possible about the truck that you want to purchase, and an honest dealer will respect that. Okay. That was our seminar for this week, we hope you learned something new, until next week we say bye bye.